and in, as a player, your, your memories of the day and particularly the, the reaction afterwards? Yeah, well, the day, I suppose, the bus was the, the big one, on the way down in the bus and the crowd and the colour and Okay, now when we got to Limerick, I think we realised that uh, it was kind of going to be like a home match for us because uh, there wasn't too much carrying people around, it was just full of us many people. Um, so, yeah, the bus on the way down, and then I think for us, I suppose as players, South and Chaco, um, coming onto the field, just actually Kerry were supposed to be first on, or Kerry were supposed to be on before us, um, or after us, but we actually made them go out first, we waited and let them go, so we just wanted them to hear the roar of the crowd and let me come on, and um, yeah, it was phenomenal. Yeah. Um, just, just the crowd and the support, the support we had all year, just kind of the, the team captured the imagination, and we just got huge support, and then on the way back, and the bus, and it was probably midnight, it was we were getting back into Monagara, it was really late, and just there was such a crowd around Monagara, and yeah, it was special. Even now, 25 years later, how much of a bond is there between the young fellows that were on that team? Yeah, hugely. Um, it's funny, I suppose football maybe back then wasn't as serious as it is now, and maybe that was probably what helped us. We had a little, and probably led by Luke. Um, it was a lovely, relaxed atmosphere, and the, the, the lads were all really good friends. We used to travel to training together and socialise together, and there was a real tight bond of players. Um, so we're actually, because of the 25 year um, anniversary, we're having a, a get together in Turles Pass now in October. And like, just lads coming back from America, coming back from England, like everyone is coming. Um, their families are coming. It's, you know, we just put it out there and the response was huge. Like the lads are all keen to get back. And we had met, actually, it's probably worth noting, we had met, um, unfortunately, in sad circumstances, one of the panel members, Enda Mulvey, had passed away a couple of years back. And we met, like it was a sad, and we sort of said, lads, oh, Jesus, we'll meet in happier circumstances the next time, you know, poor Enda passed away with cancer here about two years ago. So, and anyway, I'd like to recognise him. May he rest in peace.